Hey folks, Cooking with Kel Bob here in my ordinary kitchen with my ordinary grill dog. And today we're going to teach you how to make a favorite of our family. Something that every time we go to family dinners or we go to functions or we have to bring a side dish, we always like to bring Texas hash brown casserole. Folks, this recipe is so simple. You can make it in 20 minutes and it feeds a lot of people and it's so good. I don't know how good for you it is, but it is so good. So stick with me, five minutes. I'm gonna teach you how to make Texas hash brown casserole. But of course, along with me is Grill Dog Sherman. Great. Everybody should have a Grill Dog because when you drop food on the floor, you don't have to bend over and pick it up. So the first thing we're gonna do is wash our hands. We always wash our hands when we cook. So after we've cleaned up from Grill Dog Sherman, we're going to take a large mixing bowl and we're gonna start out with uh, two pounds of shredded hash browns. And we're gonna pour those in the mixing bowl like so, right now. Now we're going to bake this at 350, so I'm going to go ahead and preheat my oven to 350 degrees. And then I'm going to add a half a cup of melted butter, which is one stick, and Jenny and I, we like to use real butter. And then one can of cream of chicken soup. Dump that in there. Excuse me, we gotta take a break. Grill dog has to go potty. One eight ounce uh, container of sour cream. Butter and sour cream. You can't go wrong, folks. All the food groups. I'm going to add a half a cup of chopped onion, which I've already chopped in my uh, handy dandy onion slicer thingamabobby. Get that in there like so. <laughs> this is going to be good. We're going to use two cups or uh, 16 ounces of shredded cheddar cheese. I actually got two different cheese thingies going on here. One teaspoon of salt. Looks like Grill Dog's done going potty, so we're going to let him back in. and a quarter teaspoon of fresh ground pepper. We like the pepper. We love the pepper. Sherman, you like pepper? You might sneeze. What do you think, you getting excited for this one? Huh, you getting excited? You really need to chew your food. Then we're gonna give that a really, really, really good stir. We got our hash browns and our cheese and our sour cream and our onion. Folks, this recipe is so simple and it's so hearty. Everybody loves it. You can't bring enough hash brown casseroles to a, to a good old fashioned potluck. Or just to serve to your family. Now, I'm gonna take a, a saucepan and I'm going to melt another quarter cup of butter. And I'm going to take two cups of crushed corn flakes. And I'm going to sort of saute those in. Just for a couple minutes. Just kind of get that butter all in those, those corn flakes. If you're on the South Beach diet or the low carb diet, not the side dish for you. Stick to the carrots and the broccoli. So since we're gonna take this to a, a potluck tonight, I'm gonna go ahead and I, I just, I, I love to just buy these disposable baking pans because I, you never know when you're gonna leave and I hate to wait around for my pan. But I'm gonna go ahead and pour my mixed up, uh, let's do it this way. I'm gonna go ahead and pour my mixed up casserole into my baking dish so I should have something that looks like that actually I do have something that looks like this you should have something that looks like this 
So now I'm going to take my butter sauteed cornflakes. You can see what they look like. Something like that. And I'm just going to sprinkle this over the top of my unbaked casserole. After I've covered it in my cornflakes, I'm going to I'm going to cover the casserole tin foil because we're going to bake it covered for 40 minutes. He just he just waits for me to make a mistake. You just love to see me drop this, wouldn't you? You're a greedy guy. That's what you are. Oh, I forgot. I got my new handy dandy kitty cat timer. Christmas present from Grill Wife. In 40 minutes. Mm -mm -mm. It's hot, but Grill Dog, what do you think? Don't you get your tongue in that. Don't you get your tongue in that. I'm telling you what, this Texas hash brown casserole. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We're going to have to try a little. That is so good. That is so good. <laughs> it is cheese dripping good. Mm. Yes, that is so good. Folks, you have got to try this. It's simple. It's easy. It's inexpensive. This whole recipe was less than 10 bucks. For Grill Dog Sherman, Kelbob, out.